The history of the 2013 Trenton New Old Patch lot number 40 begins in 1962. In those days, the Trenton New family were fruit farmers and they worked mostly in the Santa Clara Valley high above what is today Silicon Valley. They sold that property to a group of investors who founded Ridge Vineyards and they moved to the remote area that is now known as Alexander Valley. When they purchased their 200 acre property, it had 30 acres of vineyards on it and they didn't really know what to do with them. So they called Paul Draper, the longtime head of Ridge, and he came up, took a look, and that is what is now the iconic Ridge Geyserville Zinfandel. They also planted more vineyards and began what is now known as the Old Patch Red. Now, I'm not saying I've been doing this a long time, but the first lot I sold of Trenton to Old Patch was lot number eight back in 1989. In those days, these were gritty, rustic affairs. A friend of mine used to call it the old dirt wine. Then in the 90s, they hired a winemaker named Miro Chakalov, and Miro has really improved the wines. He's taken the great fruit that the Trenton New family farms, and he's given it a polish and an elegance. The blend for lot number 40 is 59% Zinfandel, 21% Petit Syrah, 12% Cabernet, and 8% Syrah. The wine is aged in French oak barrels, and 20% are new, which is pretty unusual for a wine of this price point. When you pour this wine, and you're going to want to make sure you decant it for at least a half an hour, it's got a beautiful nose of raspberry and strawberry jams, milk chocolate, and sassafras. On the palate, this wine has great lift, but it does develop a sense of structure in both acidity and tannin as it comes to the finish. You'll want to serve this wine with something cool, like smoked pork chops with a Vidalia balsamic glaze, or you can do something as simple as smoked turkey. So enjoy.